What's up, Tubies? I got a great video for you. It's been a long time since I played solo Battle Royale in Warzone. This is mostly because I play more with friends. And solos tend to be campy. The in circles have like 15 billion Berthas driving around trying to run you over. Surprisingly, that didn't happen in this match. Now, I also went back to auto super sprint and I just grabbed the double time perk so I could crouch walk quickly and just maintain that stealthiness if I needed it. I also give commentary on this one regarding a things like positioning and a few other things too. So I was just laid back, sipping on some adult beverage as I ran the gambit. It made for a pretty interesting match. Now, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to let me know what you'd like to see in future videos. Now with that out of the way, let's roll the tape. Like I said, everybody's dropping here because of the zombie buy box, so it's kinda hot. Company. I don't know if anybody dropped at the shack though. So if you drop here, you want to go quick. He's got a lot of space to cover. And F1. Get that Claymore in the Simtex. Oh. Got Super Sprint enabled, then. Um, definitely. Door's not open yet, so that's a sign that we're good. So no one came this way yet. So we want to go to the other side, clear it, make sure it's good. Nothing. So we're good. Five hundred, and so since nobody's here, then we just go finish it out, close that out, do the rest. Money. Where's this box out right here? So we're still we're still not the box. Two. So we're we finished the round. We're good. Take that gas mask. Come through. We're sitting on ten grand. I the loadout dropper. A loadout dropout drop box marker. What the fuck is it called? Loadout drop marker. <laughs> oh wait, on the wrong way. Alright, no. We weren't actually I already bought it. Ah, the beers. Alright, it's early in the morning too, so Anyway, so then what you do, once you're down here, and you have your loadout, just drop it right here. Alright, that's good. So it's going to drop, it's going to land on the roof, somewhere nearby. You go up and you shut this door. If there's not somebody up here camping. Alright, no campers. All right, and then, boom. There you go. All right, so that's the deal. That's clearing the flight line bunker. But from here, 
then you have to move out. So you got to think about your options. So circles are going to be a southern border circle. But you don't want to be on this flight line. So you're going to either go here. You're going to go here. That's it. That's south. So here or here. If you're going north, there. That's it. There's three choices. All right. If you're going to buy some more shit, if the zombie bunkers weren't here, then you're going to go here. All right. So, but since we already bought our shit, we're good. Um, we know we need to go south. So we're going to push here and then maybe go here or maybe go here. So we're going to have choices. So you probably just want to go here. So that's what we're going to push for. All right, here we go. Let's make it happen. This guy on the uh, roof of the firehouse, we already know that. All right, we also have Lancer rounds, so we're gonna sky some trouble. Knows I'm coming. There you go. Not sure what he was doing with this contract. Now I'm getting sniped. I'm back where I started. Oh, I so would have blew that up. A lot of people driving cars, and I have the Lancer, so it's really hot here. So we need to think about rotating. Let's get back in here for safety, and then maybe uh, let's just cross the map and head to the border. completely bypasses. First I'm gonna pick a fight with his Bertha. Oh, he went down in the bunker. But he doesn't know that I've already looted all that. So there's a lot of people at airport. What other fire can we draw here? You have to think, you know, you want all these kills, but at the end of the day, everybody's gonna get mushed together in the end anyway. So you don't, you don't have to take bites. You don't need to. Or you just kill them later. <laughs> all right, there's loadout. Question is, do we need the loadout? No, we don't, because. We already have our loadout. So, we're gonna save that. So if I die, <clears throat> I can drop back on that. I don't think I've gone to Gulag yet, right? There's a guy up the hill, let's go get him. me names that's not very nice shouldn't do that the reason why I went ahead and killed him is because he was on my route I was heading this way anyway so let's go down here let's clear this border <sighs> the hate is so strong
Did I just get a sniper from up there? Let's go see. <clears throat> this is the thing though, with the lancer barrels. See, the thing about, well, I'll talk about the lancer barrels in a second. You can kill cars <clears throat> instantly with lancer barrels, but the thing about cars is they give you that third person perspective. Sometimes that's really beneficial. Helps. I didn't know I had a contract. <sighs> so we're really just clearing the border now. Looking for trouble. So positional playing. You think playing position is all about camping? No, 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 no. Doesn't work that way. Really just trying to cover your zone. So, all right, so we got a guy on ATV. So here's the thing, I got a Lancer barrel, so I could probably blow this guy's ATV up, like, easy. Oh, you see me coming, don't you? Gotta catch up with him. Ago. <laughs> there you have it. Was he oblivious to his minimap? I mean, this is the the thing about cars. Cars are so OP. I wasn't even trying to just like go kill people. And so let's go get a self revive. All right. So I just got detected by a drone. So there's probably guys over here somewhere. We're not gonna worry about that. Let's go get this, uh, go get this spy box. Hopefully I don't get sniped out of it. And why, why is there a fire cell? Like, <sighs> unbelievable. Where was this guy just sitting there? Oh, he was on his way to the buy box too, so maybe I should have drove around a little bit more. That's okay, we'll go back and kill him. That's a plan at least. So, got three kills with about 800 damage. Uh, if I get out of Gulag, it'll be four kills. And like 900 maybe, somewhere around there. Oh, no, I gotta wait. I gotta wait for somebody to die. <clears throat> anyway, so, like... Yeah, I think it'd be cool to uh, do uh, Warzone drops. I'm gonna cover different areas of the map, how you drop there, and like what do you gotta do to survive? You know, get your shit and survive. What if I won that because I was pressing both my buttons? Usually I just hit one. I think uh, maybe swinging both times has an impact instead of just going. So now where I died is all the way across the map. Actually, I don't even know where I died at. I think it was up here. Oh, it was right here. How far is that? 1100 meters. All right, so what I'm going to do in this case is go ahead and drop a... 
Right, supply and there's a car. So we're gonna go high risk. High risk, high reward. Get up. Get our car. Got a gun. That, that. I'm not trying to mess with uh, Easter eggs. I just I don't care about the skin and all that shit. So this is somebody else's car. So where do I got it? Why did it change? So apparently, if you pick up an Easter egg and you're on a contract, it'll destroy your contract, and the Easter egg will be your new thing. So I guess I'll just have to do that. Conscious. Fuck it. I hate it. Kind of stupid, but. There's a car here already and everything. I pick up any bounties. Yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> he said GG's. I handed to him, that was cool. Get me a here yet. Nog. with um, upstairs I know there's a guy over here somewhere so looking for audibles so anything with sound I don't care about the contract I didn't even want to do this in fact I wanted to expire <clears throat> but however I'm middle ground so that means I have I'm gonna have to go up to get high ground I don't even have my uh, load out. I'm using OPG, other people's guns. RP's all slow and shit. Can we work? Can we work?
So likely enemies. First, let's clear this area. The other side. Up there. I'm lagging. It's probably my hard drive. I don't know. Oh, look, an Easter egg. Alright, so we got a guy over here. So is he camping in the building? There he was. Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. <laughs> Disappears. So he's just outside of range? I like his building. Let's go get it. I mean, he's not stuck, so. He's upstairs. right above me. So he's guarding the corridor. Fuck off, man. I know, man. That's what happens when you camp. <clears throat> Next time, if you're gonna camp, at least camp with Ghost. You know? Would make more sense. But I like this building. I want this building. I think it's a better building to have, so. I'm not even ghosted. So, so let's start talking about uh, where this is going to play out. So I think other people are going to come here and want this building, so. See, they're already coming up. Hmm. How the fuck you get up? I don't even remember. players left so best positions over here Setting rally point. so I need to gatekeep Gonna hug the gas. Gas is closing in. Only five left. Oh, 
I'll deal with the other side when I get there. But for now, we just want to get you. Yes. We have time. 30 seconds. Four players left. <clears throat> Slow. Enemy UAV overhead. Position marked. Airstrike. Kill them all. Strike three one. Good copy. Strike it back. Down. Oh, two other players. Oh, they got to come to me. Oh, unfortunate. Got one right here. Troops in contact. <clears throat> so one v one. That's a win, baby. <clears throat> I missed him with two thermites. That's actually my second win in solos. I just never play solos. But. That's the way it works. <laughs> um. That was a surprising game, but, you know, position is always king. Uh, KD is just. Psh, doesn't matter. You thinking about KD? You're really just playing probability. And that's what happens. Hope you enjoyed it.